up, beautiful Jamaica hide, everybody on this uh, I just, I just woke up. Kind of dirty. August 20th, 2015. Wanted to show you the sunrise, man. Kind of bizarre looking. Yeah. I don't know if the sun's out yet or not. I look ugly. I need to do some of my ugly face. But today I'm going to go up and pick up that marijuana plant I harvested. So it'll be a fun day. Now, I'll give you a little secret if you come to an auto bay. There's, there's quite a few roads that go up in the mountains. Okay. I don't know if I should say the name. Yeah, I don't care. Place called Pleasant Hill. All those marijuana gardens you've been seeing lately, they're coming from up there. A real small community. They got water going to their place year round. Good drinking water too, matter of fact. You know, since I already told it, I'll show you a video, okay? What Pleasant Hill looks like in my next video, alright? I promise you. Quite a few stores and some homes scattered all around the mountain. But a really nice place to visit if you have a vehicle and you're just driving around not doing shit. Just probably ask where just ask where the gringo's been at. I need to meet gringo's friends. Good advice for you today. Really good advice. But uh, it's not Orange Hill, Lazen Hill. It's not in Nigeria, it's in St. Mary, all right? Smoking some hashish with some nice Jamaica bud. That came from USA. Yeah, the strain did, not the weed. Well, I was expecting the sunrise. This is the reason why I started this video. I thought it'd be a nice sunrise today. I guess not. Walking by yesterday and some old lady. Was you the ones that was swimming out in the seas way far out there? What was you doing out there, white man? Was you videoing? 
she looked at everybody and she goes, this white man was way, way out in the sea and he was videotaping. I said, I wasn't out in the sea that far. I wasn't way out there. She goes, that's farther than what I'd ever want to go. That's too far for me. <laughs> Gosh. I swam way out in the Caribbean Sea. I swear, man, it was, it took me about man, 35, 25, 35 minutes to swim out there. I was way out there. Towed an inner tube with an ice chest. Strap full of beer, food, lots of marijuana. We went way out in these reefs, crystal clear water, white sand below us, reefs all around us. Stood up on a reef like I did out here, looked around, ate some food, drank a beer, went snorkeling some more. I spent hours out there that day. But man, I was way out there. I know I was over a mile out there. At least. Cancun, Mexico. Where I did that at. That was some... You know, when I went snorkeling out here in Jamaica, I seen a lot of, a lot of life that, it's bitching. It, it, the Caribbean Sea all around. I'm gonna go to the Great Barrier Reef. I was there. I was right there in Venezuela. But, I didn't have my snorkel fins with me. That's the reason why I didn't go swimming in Venezuela, snorkeling, or scuba diving, the Great Barrier Reef. And I was there in Venezuela. How I kicked in, I kicked myself in the ass not doing it. Spending one day there just to do it. I was right there. Right there on the sea. Caribbean Sea, right there. Looking at it. Well, if you ever get a chance, everybody, I recommend you scuba diving all of Belize, all of Venezuela, all of Cancun, and all of Jamaica. Damn, I don't want to go to Venezuela. Fuck. Again? I tell you, man, they hate the white man now in Venezuela. They hate the white man. Fuck. Jamaica doesn't like the white man. Well, they like him. Pretend they like him, they steal from you. At least Venezuela, they didn't steal from you like this. I had fun in Venezuela. I didn't get ripped off. Not one time, never got asked for any money. Not like in Jamaica. Well, I must stop jibber jabbering. I gotta finish my joint. Go eat something. Go put on a shirt and find me a taxi that goes up to Pleasant Hill. Now, I met around eight marijuana growers up at Pleasant Hill already. Try 12 on another place, off of Pleasant Hill.
I met a lot of growers, all right. And I smoke every strain of marijuana that's been out here. <laughs> that's just in one hill, okay? That's not including all of Jamaica. The drug dealers and the marijuana growers I've met. <laughs> really, actually, I probably can count all of them, but I don't have the time. Till next video. Pleasant Hill, I'll show you what it looks like. It's pretty nice. It's a pretty nice place. You'll enjoy it. You ask me, why don't I just use the lighter? That other one, you can take a pure fresh hit of hashish. This, pure fumes, toxic fumes. My body's telling me to go over there, the strawberry field, and talk to him what I know. What I have in mind about the cancer treatment center in Jamaica. think they would hop all over me like flies on shit. What's really nice is I've been to Strawberry Field and they have little bungalows built already. Little private homes. Why do I want to work? Really, why would I want to work when it's what I get to do every day? Or should I try to cure people of cancer? Heal people of cancer in Jamaica. I can't do it in Mexico. Yeah, I can't do it in the United States. Yeah, I could do it in Mexico. I know some friends in Cancun. I can know, go knocking on their door. But you're probably not even hearing this video anyway.
my body's telling me to go talk to those people in Strawberry Field, but they'll just take my idea away from me. But I let anybody take my idea away from me on, on YouTube. Good luck. You're going to need lots of money to do it. See, this is what's going on. I might just film the video, the interview with Strawberry Field, okay? That way I don't have to repeat my story again. Till next video, enjoy life to the fullest while you can. I has to take one more hit before I leave YouTube. Or should I say, get this located from your brain cells.